What's up guys, it's the Rice Knight and welcome back to some more Fire Emblem New Mystery of the Emblem. So in the previous episode we completed this uh, Fall Chronicles and now we're going to take on the Dragoon Chronicles. So let's go! Episode 2 Red Dragoon So the events here, uh, this one is uh, before the events of Shadow Dragon, because in Shadow Dragon, the war is already ongoing uh, with Mart escaping and so on. So think of it as a prologue. So Minerva attacks Aurelius and then uh, going back to a post like a camp and then uh, seeing this event here that was a girl the sprite didn't uh, didn't really look much like a girl <laughs> I don't know no he's dead Macedonian army is here as well? Wait, what's going on here? What are those men doing? Uh, do I look like I'm, I'm on their side? I'm wondering also. Okay, that's really bad. You dirty the name of Macedon? Not a chance, of course. Oh, it's Hardin. A knight of Aurelis. Uh, I see, I think he's a prince of Aurelis. I have no name worthy of note. Imagine if they find if she knows if if she finds out. If she finds out who is it, who he is. Well, you know, you're wearing red armor, you have red hair, like something really distinct. Yeah, as I was saying.
Oh, come on. They're going to have Pala separate from her sisters. Guess we won't be doing triangle attack in here. I really never knew who this guy is. Uh, maybe we'll find out more about Frost and that conversation after we clear this level. Min Smith. <laughs> Archers, uh, mark them up. A horseman. Then we have uh, axe users having extended range up to here. So let's, uh, I think, let's give them a lesson, teach them a lesson. Actually, why are we gonna waste a silver weapon? And Minerva. The give chase to the thief. Minerva Not dangerous, we'll see about that What? Come on Hardin You keep on missing attacks Wait, they're this close already? So we have to fight, no choice but to fight. Uh, Roche, uh, yeah, you stop this team. Actually, just visit and wait there. Strength potion. Mm. Ooh, energy drop. Uh, we cannot double. We need to take care also of these archers here. Mm, I'm thinking. Yes. Rider's pain works for them. The damage is lacking. You're lacking damage. 
Yes, that worked. Yes, thank you for hitting a crit. For landing a crit. Now we only have to worry about these uh, archers over here. And you crit also. Okay, fine. Taste the rider's bane. Ha, <laughs> no damage. You're healing a thief? So this is Frost. Uh, can we try to talk to him? Or Hardin? Uh, we'll never know until we get into his range. Guess we'll do it the hard way then. Okay, let's visit this other village now, now that the coast is clear. Ooh, vulnerary. Thank you. We don't have healers, so that will be a huge uh, help. Okay, so that's the only vulnerary. Okay, we heal, we heal up later. Yes, you need help. I am at home here. Yes, he is from from Aurelis. Uh, this area over here. Be sure to finish each of them in one blow. Well, if we're fast enough, yes. Now I wonder, who are we gonna give this energy drop? Uh, I think I'll give it to Minerva because she is the main character in here, in this level. can actually talk to him but if we talk to him these enemies are surely gonna attack we need to distract them first uh, yeah I don't think uh, they'll be attacking if we're out of range Wait, someone is in range? Oh, who could that be? Someone can attack here. Or, oh, because he has a weapon as well. Let's try. 
And he, if they attack, uh, Minerva will protect all of them. Yeah, why are you aiding these people? Okay, we don't have a healer, speaking off. Now to avoid these enemies at all costs. Thankfully, thank you for the physics death. Now for the cavaliers, so uh, time to run. And the flyers uh, stay with Minerva. Oh boy, reinforcement. This is gonna be a bit of trouble. We can attack now. Okay, Russia, run. Run like the wind. alive okay that's not good yeah that is not good two archers incoming have to one round these guys uh, frost the uh... 13 Well, I have no choice You manage to crit. Well, I don't think that's gonna make a difference because S needs to one shot the other, the other one. That was a close one. <laughs> you have to miss your first attack. So Frost needs to... Uh, we have no choice <laughs> except for this guy. Come on, you have to miss also? Worthless, man. Ooh, thank you for dodging that. One.
Okay, we need that. Thank you. Thank you for a good level up. Oh, come on. You missed? A double miss? Oh great, it's a freaking Rider's Bane. We have to take this one. Yeah, we should live. But at what cost? The pain. Okay, we only need to deal with Cavaliers apparently. And we're tough, so uh, no problem. Wait, what? Wait, uh, I did not target properly the Physic. She's tough. She can handle that. Okay, we better heal up. Hardin has arrived. And you slowpoke gave him your sword. <laughs> Arjun, you return to shine while I heal Minerva. Go, Arjun. Good job. Oh, come on. Why do you keep on missing your attack? It was an almost uh, sure hit. Yet you screwed up.
That was a close one. Good thing Catria was there to bait the enemy. Okay, what's next? A sniper, knights, and bowmen. Uh, could be a tricky one. Two more vulnerabilities, so uh, better save the staff. Actually, no. Uh, we'll use the staff because we're going battle mode later. Uh, wolf, uh, wolf, speed 12, 12. With a silver bow. What if I give you the javelin and the tank? Bring it on, the sniper. Don't you dare come. <laughs> Don't you dare come at me. We're gonna destroy you. Wow, you're so tough. What tough guy you are. Well, magic can fix that. He's so fast and so tough. Yes, more strength, more defense. That's the way. Reach that far. Yeah, these horsemen are really tricky, you know. Having 9 movement, then this uh, <laughs> Draconite here having 10 movement. Uh, Hardin, Javelin. Come on. Yes. Good. Okay, so far so good.
Ooh, good. Now, how are we gonna... Yeah, bait this other guy first. Okay. Preparing for the final assault, you missed. You suck. Okay, it's baiting time. Okay, Minerva, we have 26. Yes, Minerva, you have to do it. No one else will be doing that for you. It's all you. Everyone's cheering for you. Munching mannequins! How am I supposed to face you directly in the battlefield, Princess Minerva? Wait, I read it wrong. Okay, again, take two. Munching mannequins! Am I surprised to face you directly in the battlefield, Princess Minerva? You're Ruben. I didn't think I'd find you here. Not after you were banished from the army for your acts of brutality against civilians. So he's an abusive uh, person. So you lead the deserters. Surrender. If you don't, I shall strike you down as an enemy of Macedon. Heh. I don't take orders from you anymore. For some reason, the folks at Macedon worship you royals as if you were gods. Yet, the crown prince fancies himself a patricide. The older sister is a charmless buffoon, and the younger sister is a brat whose only talent is getting kidnapped. How dare you? How dare you insult Maria? Who on earth could put up with a stupid military when even the countries like that too? Wouldn't you agree? Minerva the buffoon! Dastard, how dare you belittle us? I believe you've just shown your readiness to accept your fate. Yeah, we're gonna defeat you now. Heh, <laughs> not if I call you first. Just try. Uh, let's try with Hardin. Maybe there's gonna be a conversation also. Oh great, he has a 2% crit. I don't wanna risk that. <laughs> it's 2% but this is Fire Emblem. You don't know what could happen. Okay, nothing with Hardin and Ruben. So it's only Minerva. I want to dry this uh, frost and Ruben. Huh? Nothing. No, no conversation about him betraying, or betraying or something. Really now? Yeah, this makes it easy. With Wolf, it's a cakewalk. Yeah. And the level is completed.
Pella is back. Uh, I guess you're too late. We've already defeated everyone. Or maybe there's more inside. Yeah, go soldier. Yes, go do that. Oops. <laughs> How could Minerva not know him, but this ordinary soldier know him? What do you mean? They're enemies. <laughs> yeah, he's the coyote. There's no way that man is Hardin. He is Hardin. You don't want to believe your soldier, then don't. Oh, I think. I think his, uh, she is trying to protect him by not saying it. Maybe she found out, but uh, she just wanted to let him go for this time because they help each other, he, they have their values and such. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> okay, you did not uh, try to interrogate him. You let him go. Okay. Well, he's a rebel, but he's doing it uh, for his country. Okay, I think this is a good score. 549 points. Okay, so uh, that's an interesting side story. So they actually met before Minerva and Hardin, fated enemies because of the war. Well, I believe Hardin was not afraid. He could have freaked out when he found out that it's Minerva. It's the enemy. But he still went on with what he has to do, and that is to uh, protect the village and stop those bad, bad people, those bad uh, bandits and deserters of the army. Yeah, so that's... That's what happened in here. So that's all for this episode. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.